What's up everybody, welcome back to my laboratory, safety is number one priority and today we're gonna need a fire extinguisher close by and do not try this at home, adult supervision if you are a kid and go outside in a safe place, fire extinguisher, eye protection, goggles make sure not to burn yourself or like burn your eyes out or face off, you know what I mean? So just be careful because today I'm going to show you how to make a match rocket. This is something that I learned when I was growing up with friends like kids, you know what I mean? So I remembered it and I wanted to share it with you. Let's check it out. Alright, main thing that you're going to need is aluminum foil but not aluminum foil where you cook. It's from the gum, you know what I mean? You get this ones from the gum. So I saved couple from the last experiment. Hope you remember what experiment it was. So what we're gonna do is put the match like that on a edge and just roll it up tightly. Very very tightly, you know what I mean? As tight as you can. That's what she said, right? Or he. Alright, whatever. Tie it up and then you flip it like that. And fold it, I mean. And you got this kind of match with the aluminum foil like that, you see? So then we're gonna, I'm gonna put a plate and put it right here. Let's see how far will it shoot. Remember, fire extinguisher, do not try this at home, very dangerous. I'm gonna use my lighter. Boom! Well, Sometimes it doesn't, doesn't fly the way you want it to fly. Well, let's say it was a fail and I know why. You know why? Because this is, I put too much foil and it was too heavy to actually fly out forward. So, let's rip it off like this much and just roll it up over here on this end. You see how much smaller it is? Like almost 80% smaller this time. So you don't need a lot because it's too heavy. Once again, like I said, it was a long time I did the take when I was growing up a kid. So time to just remember how we did it before. All right, let's see if it's gonna fly. Yep, you guys seen it? There's a lot of smoke, that's why you shouldn't do it at home. Smoke, you don't wanna smoke up your house and you don't wanna like burn your house either, you know? It's pretty dangerous. I'm in a laboratory, remember, I have all the percussion to take the fire down. This is a special built laboratory. Let's try the other one. Set it up. Actually gonna point it at your camera guys this time. Oh, that's kinda fail. Alright guys, that's it. Don't forget about safety. Do not try this at home, kids. This is very dangerous. You'll burn your house. Maybe ask your dad if you can do it with him, because this experiment is pretty cool. Tell me in comments below how does it work. Why does it fly forward, you know what I mean? Or sometimes why does it doesn't fly forward but fly backwards. Let me know in the comments below what do you think. I want to know what do you think. And that's pretty much it. As always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time.